Hello for everyone, welcome to the channel Universal Maths. In this session, I want to show you next 10 solutions of 10 problems from the book of Ahmed Demeter. They are geometric problems, as you see, and this is the most tricky problem in this session. But before starting with this, I want to solve three or two problems. From the start, and I want to give the solution of this problem. It is the 80s problem. But before starting, do not forget to subscribe to my channel and press the like button. So, this is the 77 problem. Uh, here, we're, not, uh, we're seeing that ABD is uh, equilateral triangle, but we have to find out X here. So, uh, if it is a collateral triangle, all the angles will be each 60 degrees. And we also know that if the AD will be equal to DC, this angle will be also 20 degrees. Uh, which says that this angle has to be 140 degrees. In a sum, they will give 180 degrees and we also know that this angle ha has to be x and we can now find out this angle this angle will be 360 minus these two angles and it will give us 160 degrees one uh, two x plus 160 degrees have to give us 180 degrees from here we, we find out two x here it will be 20 degrees and x will be here 10 degrees this is the first way but the second way can be uh, uh, from the triangle abc we can write down that uh, x plus 60 degrees the b angle plus the C angle X plus 20 degrees and the A angle is 80 degrees has to be here 180 here we got uh, 100 and 160 here 2x then have to be 20 degrees again and X here will be 10 degrees they are the same but the ways which which seems for you easier you can choose but both of them correct so let's move on this is the next problem we have to find out x here again and we can see that uh, ad and uh, be they are both uh, detectors if we will continue this line this line and the line C, uh, CE will continue. We'll get that this, uh, uh, let's see, let me put here a point. This point will be a point of intersections of median uh, detectors. So this, this will be also X. The C. F C F here will be a detector, so it will be X. And we know that this if this will be alpha, this will be also alpha. If this will be better, it, it will be beta. So next step is to know that alpha plus beta here have to be 80 degrees. Here, the angle BED will be equal to alpha plus beta here. And we also know that uh, here, where it was, here, I guess, no, wait a minute. Next step, ah, here, two alpha, here, in a, uh, in a triangle, a, B, C, 2 alpha plus 2 beta, the angle A plus the angle B, and the angle C. 2x have to be 180 degrees. 
it was so easy I couldn't guess okay this is 160 degrees why is so because two times 80 degrees will give us 160 degrees plus 2x will give us 180 degrees from here we know that 2x have to be 20 degrees and x here will be 10 degrees and this is my answer I guess it's the standard solution if you have any other solutions let me know in the comments below and uh, this problem here these angel these angels are equal alpha and alpha let me put here and from the triangle b e c you can write down that x plus 110 plus alpha will equal to 180 here x plus alpha have to be 70 degrees and the next step is to know that this this angle will be 60 degrees which says that this angle will be alpha plus 60 degrees and the next equation that we have to know oops no yeah uh yeah we have to know this is 120 degrees this is 2 alpha here 2 alpha this is 60 degrees this is alpha plus 60 degrees this will be 60 also they are vertical angles <coughs> and ah uh, here it's given that AD is equal to DC uh, A here AD is equal to DC here uh, so that this angle will be also to alpha here and now it's not a problem I guess and this angle will be here 180 degrees minus 60 minus alpha yeah? yeah it will be 120 degrees minus alpha here we can add up 4 alpha plus 120 degrees minus alpha will be equal to 180 degrees here we can find out alpha here alpha will be equal to 60 degrees alpha here will be 20 degrees and if we put here we get we will get x plus 20 degrees will be equal to 70 degrees x will be equal to here 50 degrees which is the correct answer so our problem the main problem is this Let's find out x here, but before doing this, we have to say that this angle will be 40 degrees and this angle will be 80 degrees. And most students don't know how what to do in this situation because they don't know that this angle will be 80 degrees. Why is it so? Uh, I proved it, proved it in a previous sessions but now i'll prove it again if these sides will be equal we know that if we drop here a line we know that this angle will be alpha this angle will be alpha if this angle will be better here it will be better so these two angles will be equal so they will be each 80 degrees so the next step is to know that um, here to uh, this angle will be 140 degrees oh here the easiest one is to say that 40 degrees plus 80 degrees 
Hence, x have to be 180 degrees. From here, x will equal to 60 degrees. This is the correct answer. The next problem. We are, to, uh, we are given that um, um, BAC angle, BAC angle is 124 degrees, this angle. Okay, we have to find out alpha here, but before doing this, we have to uh, draw a line here, two lines. I'll explain why I'm doing so. Ah, three lines. I have to draw here the third one. It is visible that these two angles and these two angles are equal. And we are seeing that this point of intersection will be that will be the point of intersection of the sector. The sectors three B sectors of this triangle. So this angle will be also alpha. And it is obvious that two alpha have to be here 124 degrees. Here alpha will be equal to 62 degrees. The main problem was here to know that this is the point of intersection of media uh, B sectors. So the next tricky problem, in this problem, the main formula, the main term is our secret term. The secret term, that this, uh, this angle will be 20 degrees, and the secret term is that this angle will be 40 degrees. It takes time, believe me. If you find find this angle, this angle will be 140 degrees, and then you will uh, subtract from 180, 140, then you will get 40 degrees. Instead of doing that, you it is it is so easy to add up these two angles and get 40 degrees, and this will be also also 40 degrees because they are uh, these sides are equal and again if you add up these two angles you will get wrong answer because we are seeing that this angle is standing here and if we subtract this angle from uh, from the sum of these two angles we will get a right answer so this sum this sum will give us 80 degrees 80 degrees minus 20 degrees will give us 60 degrees i guess and this will be also 60 degrees and again by summing up these two angles we'll get 120 degrees and 120 degrees minus 40 degrees will give us 80 degrees and the last step is to know that this angle will be also 80 degrees 80 degrees plus 80 degrees will give us 160 degrees and x here will be equal to 20 degrees and if x will be 20 degrees the sum of interior angles will be 180 degrees and this is i guess a better so this is the right answer so the next problem again this kind of problem 35 degrees it is a practice for us 70 degrees to be the sum and this will also be 70 degrees and we have to find out this angle uh, do we have to yeah we have to find out here this angle if we find out here this angle we will get 70, 70, 140 degrees it will be, and if we will add up here 70 degrees and 40 degrees, we'll get 110 degrees, and 110 degrees minus minus 35 degrees, we'll get 110 minus 35. It will be 75 here. 75 it will be, I guess, yeah. 
and this angle will be also 75 degrees because these sides are equal BC and BC and X here will be 180 minus 2 times 75 it is 150 degrees and it will give us 30 degrees and this is the right answer the next problem here again but we are given that AB is equal to AC AB is equal to AC so these angles are equal so uh, we know that this angle will be X plus 20 degrees and this angle will be also X plus 20 degrees and this angle will be x two times x plus 20 degrees it is 2x plus 40 degrees minus 20 degrees it will be 2x plus 20 degrees i have to write 2x here 2x plus 20 degrees and uh, here we are we know that alpha will be equal to this angle so alpha is equal to 2x plus 20 degrees so here 2 alpha 2 times alpha plus x here will be 180 in the triangle abc so we can plug to this equation into this alpha 2x plus 20 degrees and we'll get that 4x plus 40 degrees plus x will give us 180 degrees here 5x will give have to give us 140 degrees and x will be here 20 28 degrees this is the right answer next problem this is not so hard uh, this was given in any type of math exams even it has an SAT so alpha and alpha beta and beta you understood I guess and we have to find out X here this is 90 degrees and uh, <clears throat> we know that from the triangle BD, uh, BDC we can write down that alpha plus x plus beta have to be 180 degrees and from the big triangle abc we can write down that 2 alpha plus 2 beta plus 90 degrees that's good 180 degrees and here 2 alpha plus 2 beta has to be 90 degrees and alpha plus beta here 45 degrees and if we plug into this alpha plus beta 45 degrees we can get that x x plus 45 degrees has to be 180 degrees then we will if we will subtract from the both sides 45 degrees we'll get 135 degrees which is which was the correct answer and this was our last problem you liked our solution thank you for your attention and do not forget to subscribe to my channel and press the like button see you soon in the next videos